I don't know what it is about him, but every year, you know, I feel like he just has not gotten the respect that he has deserved for years. And I think the players know. Tyler Stafford makes the game sound easy. Her dad makes it look easy. This year, you could just tell it's a whole different offense with him being quarterback. Matthew Stafford is back, folks. His first appearance since week 11 last year. As soon as Cooper Cup came open, he expected ball and it dropped out of the sky. Great job by Matthew Stafford. That was a very good throw you had, man. His arm strength and, you know, the accuracy is crazy. It's good to have a great receiver when you got a great quarterback. It really shows how tight of a window it is to where a ball could have been picked off, but it's all about the quarterback, how he's placing it and the chances they take. Steps up, launches, right side, Nakua midfield between two Seahawks. You have Bobby Wagner underneath, Tariq Woolen over the top, and you still make a throw where only Puka Nakua can go and get it. You always got to be stickier to the receivers because a great quarterback like him, a receiver don't be open, but he had thought to make the receiver open. So going against him was a pretty cool experience for real. He nice. Damn near Tom Brady out there. Nah, damn, he reminds me of Aaron Rodgers a little bit. I never played Tom Brady. You can't appreciate everything that he does until you sit back, turn on the film, and even knowing what's supposed to happen. There was a play that Puka caught a long touchdown over the middle, and Coach came in to film the next day, and he says, we had a completely different play on, but Matthew came to him earlier in the week, and he's like, if we get this look, we love this call. So Matthew sees the look, he sees you know, where the safeties are at, and he's like, we're gonna audible this call gets back into audible, then for him to dot it right over the middle linebacker, right in the perfect spot for Puka to take off and get going, and then that's a touchdown. Puka Nakua to the crib! Matthew Stafford sees a certain coverage, checks into another play. You can't even run and hand that ball off better than the throw that Matthew Stafford just made. And so really, the only thing that you see is, oh, he threw a nice pass, but his knowledge of the game, his control of the offense is unmatched. I don't think that there's a better quarterback out there. He's a guy who's confident in his ability, who throws his receivers open, who can really manipulate defenses. Turbo attack! Uh-oh. Did you get him? Yeah, baby. He's just casually making no-look throws. That's just kind of the swagger energy he has to him. Look at that no-look <laughs> pass by Stafford. A lot of people think that he's just out there being fancy, but he actually like moving defenders out the way with it. He didn't look this way, give him the move and just throw it right in that same hole that he just moved from. He is just insane. He's a very special guy, and our offense doesn't run the same way without him. He's doing it for a long time. Um, he's, I think, still up there when we're talking quarterbacks. He's a little older, but he still got it in him for sure. Yeah! Gotta show him you still got it. 